Until next time, it's me, Kiki the Kangaroo, saying so long. And remember, why walk when you can skip? And why skip when you can hop? See you next time! Hop, hop, kick! Hop, hop, hop kick! <laughs> Ian, look! Coming this weekend, the ice spectacular you won't want to miss. With skating champion Sonia Spencer in the starring role of Cinderella on Ice. Share the magic as one lucky <gasps> guest is chosen to skate side by side with Sonia Spencer. Yuck. Figure skating. Mom, can we go to the ice show, please? Well... Double, please? Actually... Triple, please? Triple? <laughs> well... Rule of life number 48. When you really, really, really want something, it helps to use a triple, please. Well, luckily, I have tickets for the whole family. Thank you, thank you, thank you! My skates! I have to practice. Thanks, Mom, but you can give my ticket to Perry. Dogs love skating. See? <laughs> Okay, Olivia, you can turn on the hose now. Make sure you keep the water right here. Not too fast. Okay, Julian. It's working! If it stays this cold, the water will turn to ice by tomorrow. And I'll be practicing on my very own skating rink. <laughs> you didn't like ice skating. Not the ice princess kind. I like the hockey kind. Hmm. Uh-huh. That's solid, all right. Good work, Olivia. Now, you two be careful. Want to play goalie, Dad? <laughs> yeah, how about I just watch you play? <laughs> Looking good, Ian. Dad, can you help me practice for the ice show? Uh, honey, I, I'm not really the best skater. All you have to do is this. The lucky winner is... Olivia! <laughs> Got it. And now, for the very first time at Cinderella on Ice, a solo performance by none other than the great Olivia! You're doing a solo? Oh, hi, Francine. At Cinderella on Ice? Well, I plan to be chosen to skate with Sonia Spencer. But anybody could be chosen. I guess, but... I mean, I could be picked if they don't pick me first. Can I practice, too? Okay... Yay! I'm wide open, Harold! Pass, pass! Score! It is? How am I doing? Great. Pretty good turning, excellent stopping, and awesome not falling down. That part's easy. Not for me. I'll show you how to skate and not fall down. I like not skating and not falling down. Are you sure? Oh, all right. See how easy it is, Julian? I'm gonna fall, gonna fall, gonna fall. Go ahead. You've got the Olivia Patootie pillow. See? You're skating. Yay! Whoops. <laughs> You're still standing. Whoa. Whoa. Grab on, Olivia. Oh, help me too. Hey, the patootie pillow works. <laughs> Kids, I have some bad news. I just heard on the radio that the ice show has been canceled. No Cinderella on ice? But why? Well, they had to cancel because Sonia Spencer is sick. Sonia Spencer? Sick? Oh, no! Hi, Sonia. It's me, Olivia. I'm so sorry you're sick. Oh, it's just a little cold. <laughs> but 
I can't skate. The show's canceled. I can skate. Would you skate for me? Please? Well, I mean, I'm not... Triple, please. In that case, I must. Here. You deserve this, Olivia. Aha! Uh -huh. We'll do our own Cinderella on ice. How? We're not real skaters. I even wear a patootie pillow. We've practiced all day. And besides, the show must go on. Otto, Oscar, I mean, Cinderella stepsisters. Ready? And action! It's the prince, and the glass slipper is mine. Actually, it's plastic. Oh, where, oh, where is my coachman? Whoa, oh. whoa. Oh. Hmm. Can I have a patootie pillow, too? <sighs> Catch me! Catch me! Oh, no! Oh. Good. We're getting there. One more time. Nope. And now for Act Two of our performance of Cinderella on Ice. The fairy godmother had two more things to do before the ball. And now, I turn you into Cinderella's coachman! Thank you, but I don't drive. <laughs> Next, the fairy godmother turned a mere pumpkin into a glorious coach. So Cinderella was finally ready. Skater. This is all sublime, but look at the time. It's midnight. Dear Prince, I'll see you later. My skate! I shall find the owner of the so-called glass skate if I have to search forever. Try me, try me! Try me, try me! You'll find her, Prince Charming. She's the best skater in the whole kingdom. Even better than me. You could make a bet, I'm the one you met. Till my clothes are covered with patches. It is going to fit, I am sure of it. I'm wearing the one that matches. It fits just like a glove, well a sock. And now we'll fall in love, what a shock. It certainly is nice to be Cinderella. It's me, Cinderella on Ice! Cinderella on Ice may have been canceled, but another ice show came to town thanks to a determined young skater named Olivia. She put together a show in her own backyard skating rink and even played the role of Cinderella. Olivia was nobility on ice. Mm. Sweet dreams. What's nobility mean? It means you skated just like a princess. Good night, Olivia. Good night, Dad. Nobility on ice. Today is going to be the best day ever. Actually, the paper says it's going to be a scorcher. <laughs> Olivia's not talking about the weather, dear. She's excited that we're getting our family Christmas picture taken today. And Francine's having a Hawaiian beach party in her backyard, too. 
two fun things in one day. How can Francine have a beach party in her yard when she doesn't even have a beach? The same way you get a picture to look like Christmas in the middle of summer. How? You decorate. Cool. Can someone tell me why we're getting our Christmas picture taken in the middle of July? Because every year we end up waiting until the last minute and my mother ends up taking our picture, which is never very good. Whoa. <laughs> it looks really funny. <laughs> oh, great face, honey. Oh, that's not so bad. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, what did I tell you? <laughs> this year, I'm going to make sure we'll have a nice family picture to go with our Christmas cards. Olivia, hurry up. The photographer will be here any minute. But, sweetheart, where's that pretty polka-dotted outfit I picked out? Santa doesn't wear polka-dots. Why aren't the rest of you dressed up? Where's your holiday spirit? I can fix that. Cool! Ho, ho, ho! Now we're ready for a real Christmas picture. Come sit down. You too, Ian. And don't get all mussed up before the picture is taken. Well, let's all sit here and just wait until the photographer arrives. Whoa. Uh. Sorry. Still learning how to work my antlers. <gasps> that must be the photographer. Sorry I'm late. Please, come in. Cool! Ah, yes! This little baby right here is the snow 3000. It makes snow. Not sure if I use it today, but please, I beg you, stay away from the red button. <sighs> Now, where was I? <laughs> nice sunglasses, Julian. Nice antlers. So are you ready for Francine's party? No, we haven't had our Christmas picture taken yet. Wait here. I want you to bring my beach ball. Will you hold my antlers for me? Sure. Huh? Okie dokie, folks. Places, everyone. Say Santa Slay. Santa, Santa Slay. Slay. Perfect. I think we're done here. It certainly pays to hire a professional. Did I miss something? <gasps> Say Santa's. What's that smell? Ugh, it's, it's William. William. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's my little one. Oh, and his shirt looks messy too. I'm going to have to go change his outfit. Dad, can I go over to Francine's party just to say hi? I'll run right back when you call. Sure, but you won't need reindeer antlers at the beach party. Oh, yes, I will. <laughs> Olivia, your antlers are awesome. Yeah, but why are you dressed for Christmas? Why not? Any day can be Christmas, especially a fun day like today. Hmm. Ho, 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 let's see who's been naughty and who's been nice. Olivia's been nice. Prancer! Take these to Olivia and tell her Santa wants her to spread the Christmas cheer. In the middle of summer? Ho, 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 ho. Why, yes, even in the middle of summer. Olivia has the Christmas spirit all year long. Olivia? Olivia? This is a beach party. Beaches and Christmas don't go together. Sure they do. Olivia, Mom says you got to...
gotta come back for the picture. And hurry up before she combs my ears off. <laughs> Edwin and Perry want to be in the picture, too. Uh-oh! I'm allergic to... <laughs> Hello? Olivia, what are you doing? Is that Christmas music? At my party, we have cool music. You're missing all the fun. Mom, can I go back to the party for a while? Oh, you might as well, Olivia. We'll call you when we're ready. I'll be right there. Ahui ho'u kaka'u. That's Hawaiian for until we meet again. All you gotta do is wave your arms. It makes me dizzy. I think hula music is better than Christmas music. What do you think, Olivia? I like them both. Olivia! Oops, gotta go. <laughs> Super! A little to your left, and uh, can you bring the antlers down? Perfect! All right, everyone say Dasher! Dasher! Uh-oh. Are we ever going to have a good Christmas picture? Why don't I take a look? This isn't the right color. <laughs> Whoops! Hit the blizzard button! We need to make it stop! Hey, it's snowing! In our living room. But the snow looks so... Christmassy. Olivia, try to turn it off! How? Never mind, I'll get it! hi -ya! It looks like the North Pole. <sighs> it's a winter wonderland. This is... Beautiful. <laughs> Whoa, it's awesome inside here. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like we're gonna have a white Christmas. That's it! Now everybody say Prince's Underpants! Prince's <laughs> Underpants! <laughs> <Prince's laughs> <Prince's laughs> it's perfect. Thanks to the little reindeer here. You saved the day, Olivia. It was nothing. <laughs> huh? Is that snow? <gasps> ho, ho, ho! <laughs> you know what, Olivia? Beach parties and Christmas do go together. I told ya! <laughs> and they all lived happily ever after. Ah, oh, the end. <laughs> well, it's certainly been quite a day, hasn't it, sweetheart? Yeah, I told you it was going to be fun. Don't you wish we could do it all over again? Um... Good night, Olivia. Good night, Mom. Glad you came for a visit, Grandma. Me too. What are we gonna do tonight? Let Grandma catch her breath, sweetie. She just got here. Oh, I'm fine. In fact, I've got a surprise. A magic show. Wow, a, a magic, magic show. show? Now, everyone, sit down and get ready for the magic of the great Grand Moochie. Now then, for my first trick, I'll need a coin. Anyone have a coin? I don't have a coin. Yes, you do. Wow! Do I have a coin, Grandma? You certainly do. <gasps> Princess. 
Look, William, you have a cracker behind your ear. <laughs> Olivia, in. Hand me back those coins, please. They vanished. <gasps> Whoa! Maybe they're invisible. Or maybe they've become something else. Wow! What do you say, kids? How'd you do that? Great magicians never reveal their secrets. Isn't there something else you want to say? I want to be a magician, too! <clears throat> Thank, Thank you, Grandma. Grandma. Everybody stay here. I'll be right back. I know I saw one here somewhere. Yes! My magic kit! And now, I, Olivia the Great, will also perform a magic show for you. Does anyone have a coin? Right here. And now, I will make this coin disappear. You can't do magic. Bet I can. Bet you can't. Bet I can. Bet you can't. Olivia. Ian. Now for the magic words. Wooly kahooly! Oh. <laughs> Told you so. Hmm. I think I just need a little more practice. Good idea. Practice makes perfect. Then I'm going to practice until I'm perfect. <laughs> Want to play tag? I'll be it. Not right now, Julian. I need to practice my magic trick until it's perfect. Ta-da! I don't get it. The egg is supposed to disappear. All the best tricks are about making things disappear. Hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, I will now present to you my greatest trick. I will now make myself disappear. Hooli kahooli! <laughs> Bye, Julian. Gotta go practice. Olivia! What? Can I try a trick? Not right now. Olivia? Yes, Ian? Can I please try to do a trick? Just one trick? I really want to do a trick. Come on. Okay, Ian. How would you like to be my assistant? Great. What do I do? Help me hang this up. Okay. Say the magic words, then count to three and pull the sheet down. It's very important that you do exactly as I say for this trick to work. Okay. I think you're really gonna like this one. Wooly kahooly. One, two, three. <gasps> I made her disappear. My walkie talkies. Testing, one, two, three. Olivia? Where did you go? Olivia? Ian? You've made me invisible. You mean you're here, but I can't see you? That's right. <laughs> if you don't undisappear, I'm gonna get in big trouble. Ian, Olivia, snack time. Where's Olivia? Uh, she's busy in her room. I'll just take this into her. Just make sure she brings the plate back. I will. I mean, she will. Olivia, are you here? <laughs> Rule of Life number 312. 
Even a plain old peanut butter and jelly sandwich tastes special when you pull a really good trick on your little bother. Olivia, are you still here? I'm in my room. <gasps> Whoa! Olivia's in her room, Julian. Just go on up. Julian, you have to help me. I was being Olivia's assistant and doing a magic trick, and I made her invisible. How do you know she's invisible? Because I can't see her, but I can hear her. And she ate the sandwich I brought to her, but I never saw her do it. I bet she is hiding in the closet. <laughs> Please, Julian, can you help me make her not invisible? It's very hard to do that. Grandma's a good magician. Should we ask her to do it? Do you want to tell your grandma you made her favorite granddaughter disappear? Olivia is her only granddaughter. <sighs> Even worse. Well, maybe you could try to do exactly what you did when she disappeared, and it could make her come back. Great idea, Julian. She was right here. And then I said, Wooly Kahooly. And I counted to three, like this. One, two, three. And I ripped down the sheet, just like this. Oh, no! We turned Olivia into Edwin. <laughs> Did you hear that? I know we can hear her. We just can't see her. I think she's playing a trick on you. You do? I have a way to find out. Do you have any cupcakes in the house? Make sure they're red. Olivia can't resist cupcakes. All we have to do is hide and wait for her to come in and take one. Mmm, cupcakes. Yum, red ones. <laughs> Let's run out of the table. Ian, please get that cupcake away from Perry. Come on, Perry, drop it. Good boy. Now go sit over there. Uh-oh. Looks like he already ate the cupcake. Wooly kahooly! You're back! Hey, what's going on? I said the words Olivia told me to say, and she disappeared, and she was invisible, and then she made herself appear again. Pretty good trick, huh? Tell me how you did it. How did you do it? Great magicians never reveal their secrets. Nope, they never do. Well, I don't care as long as you're back. Can't you sleep over tonight? Mm, not tonight. I have to be back home early for a class I'm teaching. What kind of class? White magic, of course. I love you to bits. Mm. Good night, Grandma. Good night, Olivia.